Hello everyone, welcome to solve this math Olympiad geometry problem. And here we have uh, these four triangles. So uh, here uh, in this question, uh, we use the uh, famous ladder theorem. So now first I will explain a little bit about the ladder theorem. So I hope so you already know about this ladder theorem, but if not so, you will understand this the concept of ladder theorem here. So in ladder theorem, in ladder theorem, we have uh, the area of we have a triangle inscribed with a, a three or uh, inscribed with a three triangle. So you have these three triangles. This is the first triangle. This is the second triangle, and this is the third triangle. So uh, the ladder theorem tells us that we have the formula of ladder theorem will be 1 over t plus 1 over uh, z. 1 over t plus 1 over z equals to 1 over y plus z and plus plus 1 over z plus p so i will explain here so first uh, you see that we have 1 over t and here this t means that this t stands for total area of all triangles so our t denotes that total area of all triangles it means that you just add the total area which is uh, all these triangles so here we see that these are the four triangles so this is one triangle which is the biggest triangle and other are these three triangles so it is total four triangles so uh, this t denotes the area of all triangles and this z denotes the area of uh, the second triangle and we have y plus z so here you add the area of first and second triangle and uh, here you have z plus p so here you add the area of uh, second and third triangle so this is the fourth triangle and it is the biggest triangle this is the whole triangle so that now first we find uh, the value of uh, t so you know that what is t t be the total area of the triangle so we have the first triangle is y the second triangle is z the third triangle is p and uh, the fourth triangle is t so now uh, now uh, here we given that the area of uh, these three triangles are if you have the area of triangle 1 is 4 and area of triangle 2 is 10 and the area of triangle 3 is 5. So now our problem or question is that we find the area of a fourth triangle which is denoted by x so that we need to find the value of x here. So now we substitute uh, all the values here and first we find the uh, area of total triangle so that uh, we have the value of y is 4, the value of z is 10, and the value of p is 5. So, we can see that, sorry, this is the uh, x because we have the area of fourth triangle is denoted by x. So, you have this is x. So, now we add all these areas and we have 10 plus 5, 15 plus 5 is 9. So, you get 19 plus x. So first we find the value of t and it is it will be equals to 19 plus x. So now uh, we use the ladder theorem. So uh, first we write the statement of the ladder theorem. So we have 1 over t equals to sorry 1 over t plus 1 over z equals to 1 over y plus z plus 1 over z plus p. So we put all the values here. And we have the value of t will be 19 plus x and the value of z is so here you have this is the z and the value of z is 10 so we have 1 over 10 and it is equals to 1 over y plus z 
and we have y is 4 and z is 10 so you get 4 plus 10 and 1 over z plus p so you have z is 10 and p is 5 so you get 10 plus 5 and now we uh, here we need a little bit simplifications and we move towards our final answer so uh, here we move this 1 over 10 in the right hand side and you get 1 over 19 plus x equals to 1 over 4 plus 10 is 14 10 plus 5 is 15 and we have this minus 1 over 10 so now uh, here we just take the LCM of all these terms and you easily get that the LCM will be 1 of 5 and when you solve this by taking the LCM you get 4 over 105 so in the left hand side we have 1 over 19 plus x so now we cross multiply the terms and you get here 105 equals to 4 multiplied by 19 plus x so when you multiply 4 times of 19 uh, it will be equals to 76 plus 4x and now we move this 76 in the left hand side and you get uh, 105 minus 76 equals to 4 times of x so in the next step uh, you see here we have 105 minus 76 equals to 29 and this whole equals to 4x so we divide 4 in the left hand side and you get 29 over 4 equals to x. So this implies that we have the value of x turns out to be uh, 7.25. So this is the area of the largest triangle. So this is the value of x and it will become 7.25. So this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.